Five men have lost their lives to gun violence at Birmingham this Labor Day weekend. The city's total number of homicides this year has now surpassed 100. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough is live at Rainy City Hall where Mayor Randall Woodfin is sounding the alarm on gang violence. Chip? Jeff, Birmingham Mayor Randall Woodfin says some of the recent murders in the city are a result of gang violence, and he's asking the various gangs in town to put down the weapons and to call a truce. Now, the Labor Day weekend gun violence started on Friday evening when a man was shot and killed while driving on Arkadelphia Road with his two small children in the car. One of his children was hit in the leg by a flying bullet. The shooting caused the man to crash into another car, injuring his children further and also injuring people in the other car. Then, just before 2 o'clock Saturday afternoon, two men were shot on Inglenook Street in northeast Birmingham. Police say they were sitting in the car when someone shot into the vehicle. One man died at the scene, the other at the hospital. And just before 10 o'clock last night, four men were shot at the Elaton Village housing complex. Two men died in that shooting and two others were injured but are expected to survive. The shooting deaths of five men in just over 24 hours prompted Mayor Woodfin to issue the following statement about gang violence. Quote, if you have a son or a friend that's in or affiliated with H2K, 6500 boys, 420, TMSG or CPMG, please reason with them. Ask them to call a truce. Ask them to lay low. Ask them to chill and put the guns down. Woodfin going on to say, quote, too many lives have been lost and none of this is worth the cycle of retaliation and death that's crippling our community and literally snatching your son's lives. For a few days now, we've been telling you Birmingham was inching closer to reaching 100 homicides total for the year of 2022. These recent murders over the weekend have pushed us over that 100 mark. Sadly, police telling us this afternoon no arrests have been made so far in these recent murders. Live at a very rainy Birmingham City Hall this afternoon, Chip Scarborough, WBTM 13.